Hey, what's going on guys and as always welcome back to another video here on the channel ladies and gentlemen as you can tell for the title guys today i am going to be showing you how to get the ray k84 wonder weapon on dlc1 firebase z if you do happen to find this helpful don't forget to leave a like and subscribe all right let's do it now the first thing you're going to do is you're going to want to turn the power so go do the three generator thing activate them charge them up complete that step if you don't know how to do that step i have a link in the description showing you how to get the pack a punch that's basically what you have to do all right, so once you have the power on, you're going to want to go into the weapons lab. Now, as you can see on screen, there's like a poster board. It's kind of like a big blueprint for the Ray K84 Wonder Weapon. Now, basically, just go up to it, click X, F, whatever button it tells you to. Once you do that, it's going to spawn in a special zombie on the map. Now, as you can see, that's where I'm going to right now. Alright, so basically, once you've made your way over to the Scorch defense area, that zombie right there lying against the tank, you're going to want to go up to it, click FX, whatever button it tells you to, to retrieve the eye, or the key, I guess you could say. Alright, now go back to the weapons lab. This is the area where you, like, basically just picked up the blueprint, and then you're going to want to go up to this retina scanner. Alright, so basically just go up to the retina scanner like I just did right there, and put the eye or the key in there. It's going to scan it, and it's going to do two different things. It's going to, one, turn on the computer, and two, open that drawer, you see, and it's going to have, like, a little, uh, little key, as you can see. Alright, now once you've picked up the key from the drawer, you're actually going to want to head over to the barracks. As you can see, that's where I'm heading over to right now. Now once you're in the barracks, um, I'm just getting um, shield or whatever, you're going to want to approach these lockers. As you can see, I'm doing that right here. Boom. You're going to want to use the key on them. It's going to open up one of those big Demogorgon Mimic guys are going to spawn in. You're going to want to kill him. And if he doesn't drop a part for the Wonder Weapon, you're going to want to keep doing that, but with other lockers. So as you can see, that guy did not drop it. So I'm approaching this locker right there. I'm using the key on it. Very straightforward. That one didn't make the noise. Uh, so you know basically when a Mimic going to spawn. So I just did the other one. The other one didn't either. So I went up to that one. That one spawned a Mimic. As you can see, I'm killing it here, and it did drop my Wonder Weapon part. So approach the part, pick it up, and boom, that's pretty much all it is for this step. Alright, now be careful, because this next step can sound very complicated, but um, anyways, you're going to want to make your way over again to the weapons lab, and boom, that computer right there. Now just listen very carefully. That computer is resembling a dartboard. So you're going to go up to it, click FX, whatever button it tells you, and it's going to go around until it is stopped three times. So basically to clarify here, you're going up to the computer, you're clicking for example F or X, and you're watching where on that pie chart, it's, it's resembling a dart, like I said, a dart board. You're going to want to watch where it stops three times. It's going to stop for like a split second. As you can see, it just did it right there twice. Um, now in that case right there, I was actually holding out my phone and I took a picture of where it stopped. This is going to be extremely helpful. So I don't know, screenshot it on your uh, console, PC, or just whip out your phone and take a picture of it like I just did. Now, once you have your three positions from the computer, you're going to want to go to the room next to where Pack-a-Punch is. So as you can see, that's where I'm headed towards right now. That's back it spawn now once you watch along here and actually see what i'm talking about this will all make a lot more sense so basically you're going to be going up to the dart table and hitting the positions where like where the computer stopped at the reason why i just bought that pistol a uh, revolver gun on the wall there was because you're going to need to shoot the positions on the dart table with like a one shot base gun and as you can see shotguns with the bullet spread and stuff uh you're gonna need to be somewhat precise so um a shotgun really isn't the best gun to do that with but as you can see right there how convenient that is the revolver is right there all right so you're gonna need a good few seconds so as you can see i used a c4 there to get some crawlers in here so i'd have some more time that is the dart thingy the dartboard you're looking for right there now i'm pulling up my phone right here behind the scenes baby so basically right now i'm looking at my phone where the computer stopped three times now the first time where it stopped i took my first photo i took i looked at it and i could tell that it was right there boom the computer was um basically it stopped right there so i shot that part looked at the second photo I shot the second piece right there. 
I'm looking at the third photo right now and then boom I just shot the third place and then after you shoot the three places you need to shoot the very center of the dart table so you need to hit a bullseye the dart table in the middle of it will open up and then boom a little piece will fly out of it I remember when I was first learning that I found it eh, pretty confusing basically to cap that up to summarize it you're going up to the computer you're looking for it stops three times you're coming down here to the dart table you're shooting the positions three times where it stops in the computer and then you're hitting a bullseye all right now on to the next step now starting at round 15 manglers are going to spawn now as you can see right here, I've encountered one, boom, right there. You're going to want to aim at its arm right there. You're going to want to shoot it, and then it's going to drop the final piece you're um, ultimately going to have to charge. So as you can see, it's right there on the ground. I pick it up, and I bring it over here into the weapons lab right there. So as you can see, it's, yeah, right there on that table. You're basically just going to put the little thing in there, and it's going to charge. Now it is going to take two full round so i put it in there at round 15 and it's going to be ready for me to take out at round 17 basically if you just go up to it try to do it before it'll give you like a quote you know easy there it's gotta wait until it's like charged and yeah all right now ladies and gentlemen as you can see this is two rounds later i'm heading back over to the weapons lab to pick up the fully charged final part boom right there i pick it up i come over here to this little crafting table workbench area and i build it boom ladies and gentlemen that is how it is done that is how you get the ray k 84 prototype wonder weapon in firebase z dlc one ladies and gentlemen i hope you did in fact enjoy the video please of course leave a like down below and subscribe if you are new if you did find it helpful and as always comment on what games you guys want to see played here next on the channel ladies and gentlemen it's been very fun to record and as always peace